Hey guys, welcome back. This video is not gonna be a travel related video um, because I'm gonna talk about my hair. Well, in particular, the braids in my hair. Um, I decided to do a video about this because before I got my braids done, I did a lot of research online. I talked to a lot of people that already had their hair braided before. And um, yeah, of course, I looked up a lot of YouTube videos about that. But I just couldn't find anything about having braids with really thin hair because my, my hair, seriously, it's like baby hair. It's so thin. If I put them in a ponytail, it's like maybe like this tiny. Yeah, it's, it's like really, really tiny, tiny ponytail. <laughs> But um, yeah, so I was really worried that the braids are going to be too heavy for my thin hair and then it's going to rip out my hair. But yeah, as you can see, the braids are still in there, so I can't really talk about that. <laughs> I can't really tell you anything about losing hair because I don't know how much hair I already lost. <laughs> but yeah, um, this video is not going to be a professional video. Well. I'm, I'm just going to talk about my personal experience with the braids because, um, yeah, I'm pretty sure there are a lot of people out there that know way more about braids than I do, but I just want to tell you about my personal experience with braids with baby hair, <laughs> with thin hair. So here we go. So I have my braids for one and a half weeks now. I asked my cousin to put them in there and again we watched a lot of YouTube tutorials how to put them in there and I'm actually quite happy with the result. I think it looks really nice. Um, we used synthetic hair, it was called Expression and um, I ordered I think around six packages but we only ended up using four and a half. Um, it was really a hassle to, to get the hair apart, like whenever we tried to put like pieces of the hair apart from the rest, it like all got tangled and messed up, it was really difficult, but yeah, we managed. <laughs> I'm gonna count them for you so you know how many braids you can do with four and a half packages. So here we go. The thing is, we spent around 4 evenings braiding my hair, which took us around 15 hours. And the day after I started to get like red little bumps all over my head, and they were really itchy. Like I tried not to scratch, but I just couldn't help. So the I tried everything. I put on like the spray I bought in a in a shop, in a, a braiding shop. Um so actually spray that is made for this issue it, it hasn't helped I tried everything I tried cream I tried <laughs> everything but still I still have red little bumps all over my head so this is really annoying I don't know why why it's like this I talked to a friend of mine who regularly braids her hair and she told me that that you get those red little bumps when the braids are too tight but I don't think the braids are too tight I mean they're tight but I don't think they're too tight. So maybe my hair is just not used to the feeling of being pulled the whole time. And um, yeah, it's, it's not really a nice feeling to be honest. I like the look of the braids, but I hate how they feel. They're so hard, they're so heavy, they're constantly pulling on my hair. Like whenever I don't have them in a bun, I have them like loose. They're so heavy. <laughs> I don't like the feeling, so I'm trying to have a bun every day, but if, if the bun is not like right on top of my head, if it's like a little bit on the back, it's like pulling my head back the whole time. So yeah, this is a feeling I have to get used to. I don't like it so far. <laughs> we'll see. 
Another problem that I came across is how to wash my braids, my hair. Because usually I wash my hair every day because like it gets really greasy after one day because my hair is so thin so yeah I have to wash it daily but with the braids it really it's really difficult like it takes forever to wash the hair and you just don't want to do that every day so I didn't really wash it the first six days and then it just I couldn't stand it anymore the feeling it was so itchy and just didn't really feel nice so I asked my mom for help. <laughs> she helped me try to wash my hair. I looked up a video. Her video was really helpful with washing the braids. I used some like a spray can. I, I think that's what it's called. I pulled in some water and a little bit of shampoo and then like I just braided it in between the braids and like tried to rub it in and then wash it out. Yeah, it was really difficult but it helped against the itchiness and um, yeah but still I think I have to do it like every second day or something because um, as I said usually I wash it daily and so maybe my hair and my scalp is used to that and if I don't wash it daily then like I don't know it just doesn't really feel nice and maybe that's what you should think about before deciding to get braids that if you wash your date if you wash your hair daily, it's gonna be a bit of a struggle having braids. I can only tell you if you have thin hair and if you want to get braids, think about it. Like, listen to what I'm saying and I don't know. <laughs> if, if there was a video like this online yet and I watched it before I decided to get braids, I might have thought maybe I shouldn't get the braids done, but no. I think I'm, I'm stubborn. I think I would have done it anyway. Anyways, I still like the, the look of the braids, but I just don't like anything that comes with the braids. Like all the work, all the maintaining, uh, all the, the pain and the itchiness and the being heavy on your head. And yeah, I'm getting neck pain, seriously. <laughs> I'm not used to have so much weight on my head. On my head not in my head <laughs> no but I'm kidding but it's yeah I like I like the look but not not the rest so you should really think about all that stuff before getting braids and I really hope I could help you a little bit with your decision of getting braids with thin hair <laughs> and um, yeah I'm thinking of keeping the braids in for a few more days but then I'll probably take them out because it's just too much struggle and yeah but I'm gonna miss them I'm gonna miss the look of it <laughs> anyways have a good day and I see you guys next week bye <laughs> we watched a lot of YouTube <laughs> of course I looked up some new stuff <laughs> I looked up some YouTube videos. <laughs> um, another problem that I came across to across with across what? <laughs>